Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Anyway, let's talk about Manchester United. I um, uh, hope we're all doing well and uh, thanks everyone for tuning in uh, as per usual. Um, fantastic show ahead of us. Manchester United against Brighton and uh, a huge, huge game for United. Um, and, uh, and as I was saying, but you couldn't hear, um, I'm quite surprised that Ten Hag's gone with an unchanged team today. I wouldn't have gone with an unchanged... I don't know why I'm talking like that because you can hear me now. Um, I would not have gone with this team today. But I'm happy he's done it because I want Eric Ten Hag this season to be judged without excuse. I disagree with Neville that injuries are not an excuse this season because if we have an injury crisis, it's definitely an excuse. But I sort of get of what he means. At Man United, you don't want to be hiding behind excuses. And I do not want to be hiding behind excuses this season. With the pints and the hairy lemon, come on. United says, it's a good day to go to Dublin on a Sunday. Oh, Ahmad, that would have been, well, it's a big chance. It's a lovely cross by, De I mean, Delo on the left-hand side here. You know, Anana plays it perfectly in. Delo gets up, flicks himself on. I mean, this is delightful play. It's so good. Ah, you know what? I think Ahmad should score. Has he got too much time here? Just gets the technique wrong. What a chance that was. Lovely cross by Delo. And, um, look, it wasn't easy. But um, the cross from Delo was fantastic. Very early days, but my thoughts on United are we're a lot more difficult to create chances against, but we're not that entertaining going forward ourselves. It's, it's like, I think there's a lot of pressing, but there's not a lot of um, chances. Here's Brighton, Pedro... Good tackle by... Brilliant tackle by Maynou. Not a good tackle. Brilliant tackle by Maynou there. But I'm happy with how the game has gone. We're definitely the better side. And we've got a good break on here. It's a 3v2. Ahmad. I think he could have done better there. Rashford still got it. Nah, trying to take too many people on. Good pass though. Martinez. Ahmad, come back to Rashford. Maynou, lovely ball into Maynou. Into Bruno, offside. I think Ahmad could have played a better pass to Rashford there. Here, watch this. Ahmad here. Now, he needed to play it there. He needed to play, he needed to play that quicker. Oh, that was a great cross in. Matoma! Oh, for fuck's sake, lads! Oh, it's Dracula FC again! Not dealing with bloody crosses! That's two! Get fucking the lit on! I'm telling you now, watch uh, watch a certain somebody here on bo both bloody crosses. Bloody crap! That is a joke. That is an absolute joke. Seagulls have landed. I mean, it's meant to be eagles, but we let seagulls last land. Maguire's saying, I can't see the ball. Let's have a look at this. What is he doing? Why doesn't he deal with this? Cross comes in. Deal with it. That, you can't do that. And then again. Oh, mate. That is a double whammy from Maguire, that is. I'm sorry. I'm trying to look at... You can't blame Masrawi on the... Maybe, maybe you can blame Masrawi a little bit on the second one, but... Maguire's positioning on both crosses are terrible. That's the first chance Brighton have had. It's a smash and grab from Danny Welbeck, but Maguire's got to deal with that first cross. I think somebody's obviously said something to him because he's going, I can't, I can't. Like bloody Orville, I can't fly. Flap your bloody wings, do something. Oh, Masrawi with the cross. It's a pain that is to concede because the way we've been playing, Rashford! Goal! Yes! 1-1! One, one. Offside. He's fucking offside again. Why are you offside, mate? Why are you offside? Why are you always offside? Why are you offside? Look at him. Offside. Offside. He's bloody miles off. And he does it again. Two times. Two times he's offside on that bloody play. He can't stay onside. 
He was offside for the first cross and he was offside for the second cross. Tell you what, it would have been a bloody jammy goal. We're in trouble here. Cleared off the line by Delo. Terrible start, this. Ah, oh, ah. Oh. Terrible start to the half. We're all over the place. Nearly, nearly 2-0. Milner, runner from the midfield again. Thanks everyone who's tuning in. Make sure you subscribe, by the way. Brighton, cross comes in. Uh, onto the bar. I tell you that they deserve this. They deserve this. We are playing shit. Make some fucking changes. Go on, Ahmad. Go on, Ahmad. Yes! Get in! 1-1. One, one. Ahmad, what a goal. SportsDirect.com. United back level. He was always going to have a moment, Ahmad. And that is his moment. Come on, then. Come on, then. That's, I tell you what, they hit the bar at one end. We're not looking good. And then we go up the other end and score. That's very much like what Brighton did in the first half, where they sort of scored slightly around Monks. Oh. Nah, I don't know. Might be a bit of offside. But look, brilliant play by Ahmad. Brilliant play. And um, I don't think the keeper was saving this anyway. But that that's wing play for you. That's wing play. Superb. Now get bloody Ganacho on and let's win it. Could be offside, some people are saying. Unfortunately, the press is gone without mount. Xerxes is good, but still a little too heavy. They're checking VAR here. I think he looked on. Get in, yes. The guy at the top, get in. Get in. I'm at 3v4. You've got to use this. 3v4. Bruno. Xerxes, Ganacho, goal! Is he offside? Is he offside? Ganacho seems to think not. No, I think it's a goal. I, was, I think he was looking back. I just saw somebody put their flag up or their hand up. Pawson's getting involved. I'm panicking. I hate VAR. I hate VAR. Watch this. Bruno, they're, they're saying there could have been an offside here. Well, Ahmad's on. That's onside. Why is VAR ruining this moment? Ahmad. Bruno's onside. Ganacha. Oh, I don't know whether Xerxes on the line. Oh, I think Xerxes is offside, you know. What's he fucking doing? Oh, fucking hell. What is Xerxes doing there? He's ruined it. He's offside. He's on... Basically, Ganacho's put it into the empty net. And Xerxes is on the line, kneeing it in. I can't fucking... But I can't speak. They're still in the attack. There it is. I don't know what to say. I, I'm absolutely gutted. I don't know what to say. I do know not... I, I do know what not... I don't know what to say. Um... I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I really don't. Um, you, you know, it, it was, it was, it was, it was, it was always possible. I think I, 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 I don't, I don't know. Look, what's McTominay doing here? Why is nobody on the back? There's not one player on the back. Where is Delo? Delo's playing at right back. 
There's nobody, there's nobody on the back post. They're completely unmarked. I mean, that is just shocking defending. The lit's like, where is everybody? Oh, I just don't know what to say. Bridge, that's the end of the clip. I'm sure you enjoyed it. In fact, I bet that's the best clip you've ever watched. So there's no reason not to subscribe to the channel, click the bell icon so you never miss a clip again. In fact, smash a like on the video because we all know only legends like videos and you are all legends. So please smash a like on the video and uh, we will see you again on the next one. Thank you very much for watching as always.